Hi, my prayer partners. I hope everybody's having a wonderful day. Enjoying Jesus all the way. I'm here at the Blackwater Conservatory by Brett, and I'm gonna do a nature walk. Um, because I've never been here before. So I'm really excited to bring you along with me. Let's check it out. So I saw a friend of mine had come out here and I was like, oh, word, don't. Okay, nature walks. Let's go into the, let's go into the paved woods. Let's get after this walk. I was going out to Lamar Dixon a lot because there's a walking path that's paved there. But I was like, I like new, I like different. This has been my year of healing and a part of that healing is physical. Physical from high blood pressure, sciatic, uh, nerve pain, uh, after my uh, colonoscopy, I learned of some other things such as diverticulitis. So uh, one way to heal is through exercise. And so I'm so grateful to God, um, specifically for the verse. And I said it in my last walking video. When the time is right, the Lord will make it happen. And he's just making some awesome changes happen in my body. Um, I visited a friend today, uh, and she hadn't seen me in a long time. She's like, you lost weight. I was like, yeah, because God is healing. He's healing the emotional wounds, the trauma wounds. He's healing me financially one day at a time. <laughs> He's healing me physically um, and in, in, in my health. He's just healing, and I'm so grateful for that. I'm so grateful to be healed just being able to come out in nature and walk and bring you guys along with me i was feeling emotionally dehydrated in the last video and this week i did the god sees me challenge and i'm feeling hydrated emotionally my canteen was empty like my love tank felt so low not that I'm not loved but I wasn't giving love to myself if I'm honest and I wasn't giving love um, verbally through words of affirmation physical touch quality time acts of service gifts look how cute this is so like there's a walking trail Cause this is my first time here so everything's gonna be cute right other people have probably been here but you know i love a good let's walk and let's see but so as you're walking they have these little spots in the conservatory check us out look how beautiful oh yeah this is worth coming to and doing videos at for sure because i want to be fit faithful intentional transformational I want to heal spiritually from feeling having feelings of not feeling seen heard and appreciated um, so this week I did the God sees me challenge and I gave love to myself by telling myself three to five things all about myself every day and then i was able to love others holding their hands looking them in the eyes and telling them what i love about them it was just so beautiful some people when i looked into their eyes they were so nervous <laughs> some people were laughing and giggling they couldn't believe like what is she talking about and then other people were like oh i love you too you're like the best and it just filled up just this overwhelming joy this wonderful peace this ah it was so good and it was to people who don't like me 
That's right. <laughs> Don't like me. Or at one time we were just beefing in the streets, so to speak. Look, it's another little thing. So there's like a couple of little points, which is kind of cool. So when you do the walk, you have these little spots where you can walk up on here. So that was the first one I was at over there. Can y'all see it? Hope y'all can see it. So you get these different angles for the water is behind you. Give him glory. <laughs> Praise him in the woods. So this is kind of cool. I think it's like 92 degrees, but it's like, it's almost five o'clock. So the temperature is dropping. So yeah, it's a little warm and humid, but it's not overbearing. So then we got a, a bench and a trash can and then another spot, but this one has some grown up grass around it. I ain't got to stop at everyone. I just think it's cool. Oh, look, a rabbit, y'all. Y'all see the rabbit? Do y'all see it? Y'all see the rabbit? I don't get to see rabbits often. I guess I get excited. I don't go out in nature much. Like I said, I, I was going to the one in Gonzales, and it's paved, so I would see the ducks. So, it's cool to see other animals. Anyway, this week was the best week because my anxiety was not even there. Like, it was like little to none. It was just so nice to tell people why I love them. Oh, look, this looks like a boat launch. And then it has another little view, y'all. Okay, Blackwater Conservatory. I'm feeling all this energy. I really am. Let's get after it. Let's, let's be in nature and have, you know, like this open concept, walking through nature feeling like everything is mapped out but it's gonna be a good walk today a good hike if you will i'm here for good walks and hikes okay and tomorrow i'm going to go ride sundays of hope um mayor boom has paid for free bike rides with this service go on the dog bikes 30 minute ride you all you, you basically ride downtown it's not guided but it is cool and i really like uh being physical being outdoors at low cost or no cost be fruitful be frugal be fruitful be frugal you know what i'm saying like i'm in such a good mood because I got that unconditional, wonderful. How y'all doing? Love this week. Like people weren't expecting it. What could some prayer partners were? They knew about it if they read my text that I sent out. But some people we're not aware of what I was doing. And I just said, can I, can I hold your hands? And then I told them, you know what I love about you? And some said, uh oh. And some said, <laughs> you know, and some said, you're trying to make me cry. And I'm like, no, but I am trying to be kind. So guys, look, it's a split in the road. You can go this way or that way. which way should I go which way I don't know I think this one is going to take you around the lake let's get into it let's go this way <laughs> let's go a little farther of course I'm staying on the path <clears throat> is she being real cute right now <laughs> out here in the people's outsides but I do not like bugs <laughs> snakes uh, any woodland creatures coming too close okay <laughs> so let's be safe I feel like it keeps going this way or you can turn and go this way and it's giving me like Port Hudson energy without the spiders and them banana spiders are real big out there 
So I'm gonna try to get back out here next week. Um, Cause I like this. Cause it's shaded. Like that's what I wish they had the Lamar Dixon, the one that's paved with the, the black uh, tarp that they had paved here, but also the shade of the trees because it's, it's giving. And then there's one, there's a, there's a, the golf course in Baker Greenwell right behind the zoo. It's so short and it has trees like this and it's walking path, but it's not as long. I feel like I'm gonna get at least, oh, and I don't have my watch. Getting all these good steps in and whatnot. Um, I don't have the length. You have to keep going around it. And I like, I like things to have shade length. But I'm feeling good. I'm feeling good. That's why I bring the phone and I record everything. So, okay. we got evidence of what the happens are. Like I said, this is my year of healing. I never talked about things that happened in my past. Past. I never dealt with traumas. And I started to speak about them this year. I got free. And then this week of love it was like, oh, it's like a wellspring of water. Because I intru I'm introducing people to the love I have from them. And whether they give it back or not, I don't expect it. I wasn't looking for it. If they chose to give it to me, great. If not, great. <laughs> it didn't make a difference. And so, but to get some people to give back that love and that appreciation, that meant everything. It just did. Look at the canals, y'all. Yeah, this is definitely, definitely make me feel Port hutchin -y. You know, and some people don't expect you to be kind to them and love on them. So when you do, it's just a really great feeling. So I'm going to keep on walking. If I get something to talk about later, I'll, I'll holler. I'm going to put the phone down so I can save some of this battery. You know, don't want to kill the battery in the middle of the woods and you need somebody to come get you. You know what I'm saying? Help. Enjoy Jesus. So again, we're at one of these little step out, get by the waters, and it's another part of the trail, and there's a trail there. And so I came back, went the other way, just saw a few people walking, people who I had seen maybe about 10 minutes ago just passed me again. So that lets me know that this trail isn't like super crazy in length, but you could pass somebody and within the time of you walking. So that's pretty cool. That's a good measure of how big this place really is. So this is where I was pointing at a second ago. And then it takes you back up to that spot where I was over there, where that might be the second spot. But I think it's cool how it's all connected. And then when you walk out, you're kind of like going up a little bit of a hill. So it's kind of giving that hiking feeling where you're not always level with the road. Back there was an opening and it had like a hill type thing. And then we'll look at this. Now I'm back at an opening. I see some kids fishing. I see somebody with a dog. So it's pretty, pretty cool. Pretty cool out here. Came out of there, guys. What I showed you a second ago, and you saw the opening with the dogs and the water. When I came back, I was like, wait, that's the parking lot. So literally, I went all the way over there and went all the way around 
and I'm already back. That is so nice and neat. This is super, super cool out here. I'm coming back. I'm headed back to the car. I loved how it was in the woods, but everything was kept pretty neat and clean. Had the little duck offs here and there. I highly would recommend this place. So there's the property. Hooper Road, Cold Meat River, and then the private property, you know. This is Blackwater Road where I'm at right now. And so I went this way. Then I tried to kind of go that. And I turned and boop went back around. So it's pretty, it's pretty neat. And they have some fall events here. So August that's gone. September the 8th, that's over. So in November, they have some wood walks in December. So there's just some things that's going on with Breck out here, the rules and regulations. And then over here, you have this really cool thing, to take pictures with kids in, and like a covered area with bathrooms and picnic area. So that's kind of nice. Yeah, I enjoyed it, I enjoyed the walk. I had a good bike ride this morning at the gym. So like, this is nice to have a second, like Sabbath nature walk back at the vehicle. Y'all continue to enjoy Jesus.